good day. The state television company Western Armenia represents the most important news for today. Today's broadcast. A session of the government of Western Armenia. The speech of the speaker person of the Republic of Western Armenia. Armenians reach history in the Netherlands and Belgium. We in our place names. Armenian's Greco-Roman wrestling team is in the first place in the team competition. A rock hoon Tom was found in the Kesach, Georgia. Support Western Armenian television. A session of the government of Western Armenia on February 17, 2024, the session of government of the Republic of Western Armenia was held. The session was chaired by Darmina Gabrahamian, the first president of the Republic of Western Armenia, and Lydia Markosian, the newly elected president of the Republic of Western Armenia. During the session, the general circumstances of the government of Armenia was discussed. Deputy Prime Minister Arman Hakopian made a report and presented the assignments done in the last week. During the meeting, and discussion on teaching, preservation and spreading of the Western Armenian language was held as the only guarantee of the preservation of Armenian identity. On February 17, 2024, the spokesperson of the government of the Republic of Western Armenia gave a speech presenting the most important events of the week. Among them was the conference dedicated to Misak and Medline Manushan held in Veterans House in the city of Andip. The speaker of the conference was President Armina Gabrahamian, who in his speech mentioned the roots of the spirit of residence in France, and Armina Gabrahamian closed the conference by reading Misak Manushan's last letter to Medline, written on the eve of Misak's death. The spokesperson talked about the ninth session of the first convocation of the National Assembly of Western Armenia. The Speaker of the Government of the Republic of Western Armenia also mentioned about the 100th Presidential Decree of the Republic of Western Armenia regarding the composition of the fourth successor government, which was approved by the newly elected President of the Republic of Western Armenia, Lydia Markosian, according to the application of the first President, Armina Gabrahamian, on February 8, 2024. In her speech, the speaker also mentioned about the magazine of 16th issue of Western Armenia. Armenian traces in the Netherlands and Belgium come from the old times. Perhaps the first significant contact between the two nations took place in the 4th century when Armenia became the first Christian country in the world. Monks who professed Christianity spread throughout the world. One of those missionaries was Cervantes, who in the 4th century became one of the first who preached the gospel in Western Europe. He believed to be the first to spread Christianity in the Netherlands and became Bishop of Tongeren. According to various sources, Cervantes came from Armenia to Western Europe to preach Christianity. He is considered a saint as well as many miracles are attributed to him too, some of which continued to be remembered after his death. Cervantes is the patron saint of Maastricht, Netherlands, as well as Saint in Netherlands and Greenbergen, Belgium. We and our place names during the during the time of renaming the monastic complexes, monasteries and churches, Turks sometimes simply resorted to the counting method. They counted the number of churches including in the monastery complex or the number of altars the church has and renamed the Armenian historical and cultural monument by that date. Thus, in Western Armenia, in the southeastern coastal region of Lake Vena, to the east side from the Van city, located on the slope of Varaga Mountain, Varagavank, which was a prominent literary and cultural center in medieval Armenia, and where Hrimian Haidik founded a printing house in the second half of the 19th century. For the seven churches, included in St. Astvatatin, St. Georg, St. Hajj, St. Hovanes, St. Nashan, St. Sion, Sophie, included into the monastery complex of Varagavank, the monastery Turks called Yedi, Kilis. It means that Edi, it, uh, Edi means seven Kilis church. The monastery was founded by Grigolus Savoric, who baptized the Armenian king Terdat and others in the waters of the Arzania River and placed it. Turks renamed the monastery to Uch Kilis, which means free Kilis means church, in order to have three altars. The Greco-Roman style wrestling team of Armenia won three medals at the European Championship and Artur Alexanian, the championship of the Olymp Olympic Games, won his seventh gold medal at the European Championship. Malkhas Amoyan became a gold medalist for the first time. Mamel Khachatyan became the bronze medalist. In the area of Ohanavan village in the Georgia of Kazakh, a rock hoven town was discovered, which according to the preliminary assessment of experts is attributed to the early Christian period. The town dates back to the early Christian area, which means that it is a greater culture value. 
it is not inestimable value for all us as well as for professionals in the field. In the near future, many studies will be carried out, historical sources will be compared as a result of which the true historical value of the tomb will be revealed. The separation of the area is also highlighted by a number of interesting specimens that have been found. Olive lamps and various clay objects were found which the resident has already handed over to the relevant structures. They will be cleaned, examined and handed over to a suitable museum. We hope that there will be new interesting discoveries as a result of the exhibitions. After discussions in the expert committee, the monument will receive the status of a newly discovered monument. In the first stage, an appropriate maintenance agreement will be signed by the owner of the area, where his obligations will be recorded and the next steps will be implemented based on the results of the studies. Support the television of Western Armenia. Western Armenian television, being loyal to its principals and viewers, continues its uninterrupted work with new approaches. As you already know, our television does not engage in self-promotion. It mainly broadcasts the history of Western Armenia and political and other contexts related to the present and the future, as well as news raising various issues. We also present the political transition of the President of the Republic of Western Armenia, the government, the National Assembly, and other structures in a transparent and accessible manner. Dear compatriots, with your support, the possibilities of our television will be further expanded and strengthened. We are strong together. This was all for today. Goodbye. <laughs> Me as she caro, I darna.